Hi, I'm Nick Robinson, editor and publisher of SleepLikeTheDead.com, the leading and unbiased source for sleep product research. Latex mattresses can be made using 100% natural latex or blended latex. Blended latex being a combination of natural and synthetic latex. Now the two mattress types have the same basic properties, but they can differ in the details. So based on our latex mattress research involving over 650 actual owners, let's compare and contrast natural latex and blended latex mattresses. And let's begin with owner satisfaction. Natural latex tends to rate about 15 to 20 percent higher in owner satisfaction. And as we go through the comparisons here, here you'll get an idea of why that is the case. Natural latex comes from the sap-like extract of the rubber tree, whereas blended latex comes from the rubber tree and synthetic materials, namely petrochemicals. In regard to off-gassing, which is the release of a chemical-like odor or gas when the mattress is new, natural latex mattresses have little or no problem on this issue. Blended latex mattresses have a moderate problem because of the presence of the synthetic latex. However, it is, it is not a widespread problem. Uh, no more than 10% of blended latex mattress owners report a significant off-gassing issue. In regard to firmness, natural latex tends to be a little bit softer than blended latex. In regard to the elasticity and responsiveness of the mattress, natural latex tends to do better on this issue. In other words, natural latex tends to provide a more cradling feel than blended latex. In regard to the mattress compressing or forming body impressions, natural latex tends to do a little bit better on this issue than blended latex. In other words, over the course of its life, a natural latex mattress is more likely to maintain a flat level sleeping surface. In regard to quality consistency, blended latex tends to perform a little bit better than natural latex. And by quality consistency, I'm referring to the consistency of quality throughout a specific latex mattress and the consistency of quality from one latex mattress to another. Blended latex tends to do a little bit better on this issue because the synthetic latex is easier to work with and it's easier to produce a uh, quality product consistently. In regard to allergic reaction potential, about 3% or less of the population has an allergy to natural latex. So an all-natural latex will have uh, somewhat of a higher likelihood of, of triggering an allergy than a blended latex mattress with its synthetic uh, latex content. In regard to price, natural latex tends to be a little bit more expensive, all things being equal, about 20% more expensive than blended latex. So bottom line, an all-natural latex mattress may be best for you if you're looking for something all-natural as opposed to something with synthetic content, something that may off-gas. It may also be best for you if you're looking for something that has a little bit of a softer firmness level. A blended latex mattress may be best for you if you are looking for uh, something that is a little firmer and or if you are on a tight budget. Now I've just discussed one aspect of our latex mattress research. You can get the whole story at our website. We get into Talalay versus Dunlop processing methods, and we rate and compare the different latex mattress categories and the different latex mattress retailers and brands. You can get to our website by clicking the link below this video or by going to sleeplikethedead.com.
LatexMattressRatings.com and searching for latex mattress ratings.